Hello, just a quick video to let you know that our short film Type 2 Bleed is finally having its London debut uh, as part of the Unrestricted View Film Festival, so thank you Unrestricted View, on the 1st of November from 6pm as part of a block of short films known as Tiny Terrors 1. Uh, it's £8 for a ticket and there is a link in the description of this video and if you click that you can buy, buy tickets for you and your mates and come along. Uh, I'll be there, Duncan's trying to see if he can be there as well and a few other members of the cast and crew. Um, and we'd like you to join us and have a bit of a Valverde knees up if you fancy it. Uh, we'll go watch the block of shorts and then we'll go to the pub afterwards and hang out. We thought it'd be fun to get you involved. Um, whilst I'm here, we thought it'd be nice just to give you an update on the state of play with the film. Um, we've rented a few different film festivals over the summer and uh, things have gone quite well for us. We've won a few awards now and we've had a few nominations as well and runners-ups and things like that. So um, we started off by getting Best Horror at the Apex Film Awards um, and then later we had Best Pulp Film at Wild Indie in Greenwich. Um, we won Best Horror Short at Lit Scares in Harrogate and they even posted me this snazzy trophy which sits on my shelf usually. Uh, and then uh, past couple of weekends ago in Derby we won Best Short Film as well. Uh, we found out that the Dark Hour Awards, I've got a notepad here with notes in it, uh, the Dark Hour Awards gave Liam, our composer, best music, and Dan, who made this post you can see up there on my wall, uh, a very well-deserved best post reward as well, and we had uh, nomination status at Cardiff Mini Festival, uh, and we lost out to a really amazing film called O, which I'll try and find some details about for you, and um, we were finalists at Brighton Rocks down here in Brighton, just down the road from my flat, so... Um, it's been a very busy summer. Uh, coming up, we will be at Dead or Day Horror Festival on the 16th of November. That's a day-long event uh, in Widnes. Widnes, the fitness. So if you're in that part of the country, um, that would be worth checking out. I will try and make it, but it's quite far. Um, unrestricted view, as I just mentioned, the 1st of November coming up. And then we are going to be screening at the Norwich Film Festival as well in November. But uh, they've confirmed the dates with us. They've asked us not to publicise them quite yet. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, quite a lot's going on, and we'd like you to come and celebrate with us on the 1st of November, if you can. Um, London being very huge, we know a few of you are in the area, it's easy for a lot of people to reach, at least in the south of England, sorry, north of England. Um, if I can come to Witness, I will. Um, yeah, so that's it. We've uh, got stuff going on. There are still more festivals waiting to announce uh, that we're hoping to get into, but it's just been a really really good summer for the movie um once the festival run is complete next year we will put it on youtube for you to watch um and we're thinking about perhaps doing a private patreon screening as well but there you are uh things are going really well for the movie so uh if if you want in first november um from six o'clock at the hen and chickens in islington and we'll see you there <laughs>